Right, so today we're starting off with one truck, one chainsaw, and one plot of land. Not to mention, no money. Alright, well, here we are. Going to get started. So, we have, like I said, one truck, one chainsaw, plot of land, and no money. But, we have a dream to become a farmer. So, let's go ahead, run on down to our new plot of land we have here. And I guess we're just going to start cutting down some trees. Um, I hear the logging business around this area is pretty good recently. There's a few plot of uh, there's a few spots where looks like there are quite a few trees. So let's go on down here and see what's going on with the place. Rolling up here, looks like we have some water over there. Uh, a little bit of water over there. A little cement pad to park our trucks. And over here is where the magic happens. So, I'm going to go ahead and pull the truck around here. So, this is the plot of land that we own. Right here. All the trees on this are ours to log. So, let's go ahead. I guess we'll just start chopping down a tree. I guess we'll start with a big one right here. Go ahead, cut down our first tree. This is going to take a while, though. So, I'm going to be time-lapsing most of this, probably. Just so I don't make you guys extremely bored but let's go ahead and probably start the time lapse and i'll probably see you guys when we have done a few loads i've seen a lot of change been through a lot of pain some things are not the same as they were a year ago but all will be okay i move on each and every day the past is where it stays, way back a year ago I've changed for the better this time I thought I would never be fine I strive just to say I'm alright And for the first time in a long time I'm alright I've seen a lot of change been through a lot of pain Some things are not the same As they were a year ago But all will be okay I move on each and every day The past is where it stays Way back a year ago Back a year ago Fight and misbehave Had to find a way to change 
I had to leave to find my way Caught up in a daydream, I be in my mind up there almost daily It's how I pass time, no opinions safely It's how I understand what I want in this place, see Cause everybody wanna tell you bad things What could go wrong, what fame brings, but Success is a finicky thing And if you ain't sure, no, it'll never be I don't wanna let myself down, myself Alright guys, so we're getting really close to the point now where we can actually buy a trailer. Now, I think buying a trailer would be probably the best decision right now because we obviously can't afford much. I mean, we have $7,000 in the account right now. So, I'm guessing that'd be good. I know um, the in-game trailer in Miscellaneous over here is good. Actually, I never looked at the other options. All right, scratch that. There's no other options. So, um, actually, oh, uh, wait a second. What if we went with this one here? This is, okay, this is 9,000, but we could probably go with this one. Make it bumper full. We'd probably go gooseneck because I know this truck, truck does have a gooseneck. Um, doesn't look like it, obviously, but that's, um, these trucks do have goosenecks, I'm pretty sure. So... We could probably tow it with this truck. If not, then we get a bumper pull uh, hitch put on it. Um, I think we're going to do that. We could also use the uh, TLX truck. Um, I don't think we'll be able to afford that anytime soon, though. So what I've kind of been doing is I'm kind of just cutting these trees really big, like into really big pieces. Because I'm pretty sure, at least from what I've heard in the past, um, the bigger trees or the bigger pieces sell for more which actually seems pretty realistic so i've kind of just been stacking them a little unrealistically and a little awkwardly on the truck um so we get a little bit more money from them just so we're not sitting here time lapsing what would be like five hours of work possibly um so let's go ahead here put this last one on I'm going to take this last tree down. Actually, no, I better put another tree on this because we need 9k. That's right. So we need to earn 1,000 from this load. I think we'll be able to if we put um, both these trees on. I actually just had another idea. Wait a second. Instead of stacking the logs on it like this, let's pull ahead a little bit so we get, get a little bit more room to work. I'm going to move these down a little bit, actually. Uh, okay, not down a little bit, sorry. Um, like this. If we stack them, oh, that actually, actually, you know what? This might be the, well, um, if we don't do that, thankfully I have super strength. Um, if we don't do that, then this would work. Um, if we do end up doing that, then this isn't going to work at all. So, what I need to do is I need to pick up the log back up a bit here put it on the truck and then leave it and then i'm not sure what's going to happen with these ratchet with the uh, ratchet straps uh like with the straps that are going to go on this because let's actually see what's going to happen so okay they're going to extend all the way through the bed okay well as much as that's not realistic i think that's what we're just gonna have to do for now so i'm gonna continue doing that uh what is going on with this chainsaw i had this uh i had this problem a while ago I thought I fixed the problem with removing some of the mods that I had downloaded but I don't know because it seems to be happening still so I might have to go through my mods folder um, for this uh, save game and delete a few that I don't need I can't think of a I can actually think of quite a few right now that I probably don't need so let's um okay now that we're oh okay I'm gonna say now that we're just uh, hanging there over the water go ahead cut this cut it right here probably just cut it straight in half actually it's gonna be a very long piece of wood though all right let's go ahead grab this here put it on the truck do that real quick uh perfect all right now this is gonna be actually pretty interesting getting to the shop even uh yep no that's way too long okay 
We're gonna cut this perfectly in half, I guess, then. Yeah, I don't know. For some reason, I have to, like... I have to, like, get into the truck and then back out of the truck, if that makes any sense. So the chainsaw can cut. I don't really know what's going on with that. I'm pretty sure it's a mod conflict. I'll uh, probably look at that before the next episode and see if I can get that figured out and remove whatever mod is uh, not working perfectly with the other mods I have in here. So, let's see. Now that the brakes are terrible because we have, like, probably a few thousand pounds of logs on the back, let's just go ahead and add one more, you know, naturally just add one more log even though our truck can't handle it. Um, you know what? That's I'm going to say that's good. I'm going to strap it all down real quick, and there we go, perfect. Um, okay, that's not going to hold, is it? No, it's not at all going to hold. All right, let's um, move this one off real quick. Oh, please get up there. Perfect. All right. Now that one's right there. So let's continue putting these on. And there we go, perfect. All right. Let's head down to the shop now. Um, watch out for that stump there. So I'm gonna have to back up a lot of the way here, I think. Just like, just get out of right here. And turn around, and perfect. All right, fold up the tailgate because we literally have no reason to have it down. There we go. Um, yeah, watch out for rocks. Watch out, watch out for um, a bunch of other stuff. Going first person here. So, we should be able to get enough to afford the trailer now, I would assume. Um, it's going to be quite interesting to actually see how much we get real quick. Uh, we're going to hit this flower box, probably. Oh, we're not. Nice. Okay. I was on the brakes that entire time coming up this. And, like, for a little ways there, I was on the brakes. And that thing did, this truck, this thing did not want to stop. All right. I'm going to see if it will sell right there. Uh, of course, I parked over the trigger. Oh, it does. Nice. That is a lot of money. All right. So let's go ahead here, see what we can do. We could buy the, okay, li Lizard Logistics trailer. Let's just go. Can we actually, oh, we can change the main color. Okay. Um, no. Uh, we'll go with, uh, we go with, like, nice black rims. Oh, we could. Wait, can we make this black? Ooh, that actually looks kind of good. All right, we're going to do that then. So $10,000. And if the bumper, or not bumper, well, if the gooseneck doesn't work, of course we hit that. If the gooseneck doesn't work, then this isn't going to be a very good idea. Let's back up here. Hit, uh, get it on the hitch. It actually pulls it. I am honestly kind of surprised. All right. I'm going to go back to the um, place now, guys, and I'll see you guys when I'm down there. All right, so I figured out that this truck does not like to be pulling this trailer at all. Like I actually spun out a few times coming down here and I'm probably going to do it again. So, oh, wait, a, okay, okay, <laughs> that, uh, that got me a little scared there for a second. So if you look up in the top left, I was selected on the truck and I need to be selected on the trailer for the strap. So I thought for a second this trailer actually didn't have straps, which obviously for what we're doing would be really bad. So I'm just going to park it right here, honestly, and start cutting down trees. Now, I don't think I'm going to time lapse this, so I'm kind of just going to talk through it while I'm cutting down trees here. All right, let's go ahead, trim all the small branches up. Definitely a lot of foliage on these trees. I like it. All right, let's uh, cut it. We can't cut it too. Uh, we can't cut it into too big of pieces because you gotta remember it is going on a trailer. It is being carried by. Well, what this be? Not even a. Probably the truck probably wouldn't even weigh a ton. I can actually figure out how much the truck weighs. Just a second. It weighs um. 1.8 tons. So it's actually over a ton, which feel like is not right for some reason i feel like this truck should not weigh a ton because a half ton truck I feel like well honestly i think this truck would fall into your like ford ranger category to be honest it's not it's not the biggest truck but it's not 
I don't know what would be would be a smaller truck. I know Nissan makes some trucks. I think um what's a what's a, another truck? I'm not really sure. Before I go off talking about trucks for the next half an hour, continue cutting down some trees. And maybe that was in a uh, kilograms. She didn't didn't really look that good at it. Maybe it is in kilograms. Um Go ahead, put this small tree here. These trees are so small, you can literally just put it right on the trailer. There you go, perfect. And we have uh, another big tree to our right here. Mm, looks like a couple. Uh, like then we have like four or five small little trees over here. So let's. I'm gonna get this load. Oh no. Um. We're gonna just pretend that didn't happen. Achoo! Oh, uh, sorry, I had to sneeze. Uh, oh, oh, would you look at that? Perfect, it's off the truck now. All right, let's go ahead, um, pretend that never happened. And of course, the chainsaw is messing up again. All right, there we go. Let's get all the foliage off this tree now. There we go, perfect. Let's see, I'm gonna cut it right. Let me cut it right here. Probably, mm, might be a bit risky. I think I can do it, though. Pretty sure. Yep. All right, we can do it. Perfect. There we go. We're doing it. Yeah, so this piece is way shorter than the last one. Oh, maybe not, actually. Maybe they're about the same. Oh, catch it. Nope, I can't catch it. Let's go ahead and put this on, then. Perfect. All right. So, we're obviously going to be able to fit a lot more on this trailer, Kind of where the truck can go though i think right now the truck is actually the limit of this so really whatever the truck can handle we take i guess and whatever the truck doesn't handle we leave i guess is how we're gonna have to do this um because for the 1.8 tons that truck is you can even see down in the bottom right how heavy the trees are so this one is looks like we got look like we have 1.2 tons looks like in this this uh this log right here in this one we have 371 kilograms we have 124 kilograms one ton 204 kilograms 163 kilograms so yeah we have uh definitely a few tons of trees on this truck on that trailer sorry right now so, also, um, I thought I should explain a little bit better, since I haven't really explained. The goal for this series is to start off, like I said, one, one truck, one chainsaw, and me. And a plot of land. So, with cutting down all these trees, we're going to earn enough money. And on this plot of land is a small field. So, we're going to get probably a small tractor cultivate this up plant it maybe lease a combine or find a small combine around here for sale or something i'm not sure i know there are a few farmers around here that might have some equipment for sale come the time we actually need it but right now we're sitting kind of good at six thousand six hundred and eight dollars so we're not doing too bad right now and what is this chainsaw doing i'm honestly um Kind of thinking about leaving the game real quick and uh, removing a few mods, but it'll be fine for this episode. So yeah, and then eventually we're just going to get a huge farm, probably get some animals out here. And just go from there, we'll just continue working up on the farm. And then with this series, we'll be able to look back in a while from now. See where we started, which was a truck, chainsaw, and a bunch of trees around here. So, let's see. Hmm. Right, okay, I'm going to turn this around. So, I know a lot of you are going to get kind of upset with this being so unrealistic, but I kind of don't want to take time to cut the tree up right now, so... I mean, it works. It kind of looks like a swordfish, but I mean it works, so we're just going to go with it. 
so let's go ahead and put this tree on here. There we go, perfect. Oh, looks like we got another one right here. Nice. All right, awesome. That's all I'm going to take for this load. Um, I'll see you guys when I get down there, because this might actually take a little while. So I'm actually realizing that I didn't get that many logs, but for the amount of weight that's on this trailer right now, I think if we went with any more, we would have a lot more problems, because I've went this entire way now from the land we own so from the farm and i'm only hitting like 80 kilometers an hour right now so yeah i feel like any um of course it slows down just fine but i think uh, any more trees and we would have had a couple issues with the driving all right so let's just pull in the i'm not even sure what you'd call this Swordfish? I don't know. Perfect. $7,146 worth of wood there. Um, let's see real quick. So, f looking, like, obviously for the future here. Um, cheapest tractors. Well, looks like we have this little one. The Landini, looks like. 39000 Pretty nice. Um, looks like it's electric. Mm, whoop, not by. Um, I'm not really sure how electric would work. Uh, this is gas powered. Looks like 100 horsepower. That one would be decent. And we do have the used tractors also. So every day, I think it might be, or however long, um, you gotta wait. But all these, so this is like 52% off, 50% off, 59% off, 50% off. So eventually you'll just get a bunch of random stuff in there. And we might even find a tractor in there. But you guys, I think we're going to save that for the next episode. We're going to continue getting more logs. Um, I'm going to pick up the video right where we left off, right here. So there's not going to be any off-camera work. This is all going to be on camera. And I'll see you guys in the next video. If you guys enjoyed it, hit that like button and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.